Basta mong i-access ang inyong PLD Fiber o modem router. Pero ito ang bumutata sa iyo. Admin account unavailable error. Ano ang gagawin mo? Ang una po natin gawin is to know your Fiber o modem router software version. Paano ba malaman ang software version ng inyong Fiber Home Modem Router? I-access po natin ang ating Fiber Home Modem Router's Basic Admin. So open po tayo ng web browser. Sa web address bar, type lang po natin yung 192.168.1.1. Make sure na naka-HTTPS po yan. Tap, enter, or go. Dito sa login page, input lang po natin admin as username at ang default password po ay 1234. And then tap login. If this is your first time to access the basic admin, you will see this initial login. You will be prompted to change the admin password, the Wi-Fi name, and Wi-Fi password. Just follow the instructions carefully or you can watch this video. Check the link in the description. Once done, login po tayo using the admin at yung bago po nating password. Dito sa status tab, you will see your router software version. At yan po ang software version ng aking modem router. If ang software version ng inyong modem router ay isa sa mga ito. Log out po muna tayo sa ating basic admin. Then dito sa username and password, input this credentials according to your router software version. For RP2627, Ito po ang username and password for RP2631, 2602, and 2613. These are the credentials. For RP2646, RP2662, and 2684, ito naman po ang kanilang super admins, username, and password. Now, top login. Navigate to the bug switch and enable the web admin switch. Make sure na nag-click or na-tap po ninyo yung apply. Log out, then change the URL or the IP address from 192.168.1.1 to 192.168.1.1 slash FH. Make sure na naka-HTTPS po yan at naka-administrator. You can now log in gamit ang admin PLDT account using this credentials. Now, tap login. Yun, wala na ang admin account unavailable error. O, oh, mag-like ka na bago ka ng error. What if ang software version ng yung modem router ay RP2649, RP2740, RP2804, at RP2841? FYI lang po mga kaiti. Ang mga versions na ito ay wala na pong debug switch or super admin or web admin switch. To solve the admin account unavailable issue, remove the FOC first from IOO or sa ilalim na ninyong router. Just be careful lang na hindi po ninyo masira ang fiber optic cable. And remember the FOC port pattern para madali po natin ito mabalik mamaya. After the FOC removal, restart the router. Wait until na mag-red LOS po ito. Kung naka-red LOS na, sa web browser, sa web address bar, input the URL 192.168.1.1 with slash FH. Make sure na naka-HTTPS po yan at administrator. Now, import this credential. You just access your admin PLDT account. If you still receive the admin account unavailable error, Ibig sabihin, hindi mo po nasunod ng tama ang pagkasunod-sunod ng guide natin. So, dapat remove the FOC first, restart the router, then access the admin PLDT account. Para naman sa software version na RP2920, 2931 pataas, 
Removing the FOC alone will not work in this software version. To get rid of admin account unavailable error, you must remove the FOC first, hard reset the modem router, kung paano po yan gawin, meron na po tayong guide dito, check the link in the description. After the restart, dahil mag-auto restart po yung modem router after the hard reset. So dapat naka-red LOS na po yung ating modem router. Now sa web address bar, input 192.168.1.1 with slash fh. Dapat naka-https po yan at naka-administrator. Input this credentials. At yan, you will be redirected sa initial login. Just follow the instructions carefully. Meron na din po tayong guide about that. Check yun lang po yung link sa description box. After napalitan na po yung admin quality password at yung Wi-Fi name at SSID at Wi-Fi password, nilagin po tayo using the URL 192.168.1.1 with slash fh. Sa login page, input po natin admin PLDT at ang bago po nating password. Make sure na naka-HTTPS po yan at administrator. Voila! Na-access mo na ang admin PLDT account. Ang issue lang po nito sa mga software version na ito mga ka-IT sa RP2920 at 2931. After the hard reset, ay meron pa rin po kayo internet connection. Kaso para mawalan po kayo ng dial tone. So to solve that issue, itawag nyo lang po sa 171. 